guys, it's Gameboy Luke here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Emerald Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke in the previous episode. We finished up at the abandoned ship, tried to find TM13 for Ice Beam, which was randomized to Mind Reader, unfortunately. Uh, we did catch a whole bunch of other Pokemon, and we have a collection of Pokemon in our box now that all evolve fairly early. So I'm going to spend uh, the time in between this episode and the next, I believe, to um, uh, get them all ready so they're pretty much going to evolve instantly so we can have a whole collection of evolutions on screen for the following episode, which will be really exciting. If you guys are hyped for this episode, please do leave a like rating down below. You know how much it helps the channel and the, the video and stuff. Without further ado, uh, let's go ahead and proceed to continue through here. Uh, I do believe we can't head to the right yet, uh, so we have to push this one out the way. Anything with a one space above the strength block means we can't push it, I don't- I think, so we can just... Well, I guess we can come this way, we can push this out of the way, but I'm gonna check what's this first. Okay. This one might have an item or something in it, because I think that's main stuff, so if I push... This bad boy two spaces back, one... Oh, I left the room. I have to activate strength again! Alright. Bam. Bam. So there's two rooms. I think this one, uh, doesn't... Leads you anywhere, but potentially uh, gives you an item, maybe. So let's have... Okay. Maybe not. We have to do this bottom one right here. Alright, cool. So my head here. Uh, head here. Nope. Here. Uh, for head this way. Okay, cool. So this is a... Wait. So this is the correct way. So I just went the correct way. What's the left door? What does the left door lead to? Hold up, hold up. My curiosity. I wish to know what this door leads to. Hold on. Hey, I'm gonna do the freaking... Oh, I can't even leave now, actually. I locked myself in this room. Shit, I don't know what that... I have no idea. Don't remember at all what was in that other room and I had a funny feeling I, I got I thought I, got, I thought I got them right way round but apparently not just kind of lame you can tell how many times I've done this puzzle because it's like as soon as I do it I'm just like yep cool uh this way that, well actually you know what never mind <laughs> the second I brag about it the second I fuck it up that's hilarious we go here uh let me go this way that was it sorry I had to sit there and think about it Jesus I'm such an idiot you zip around, it drops you off here, and boop. Alright. Can I do the strength puzzle or fight the trainers? Let's just fight the trainers. I can do the strength puzzle pretty quickly. Uh, in, the, in verses, I normally run through uh, by destroying the, the strength blocks and stuff. Um, but, obviously, we're not in a verses. I'm not, I'm not trying to run against time. Most Emerald Let's Plays I do are like 20 to 25 episodes. We're on episode like 36 right now. And I'm enjoying the shit out of it. Like, it's not even... I'm not even trying to drag it out or anything. I'm just trying to catch all the Pokemon. And know all my typings and stuff like that. I just want to know what, what this... What this game has to offer. It's, it's hella fun. Um, let's go ahead and flamethrower you. I'm going to switch you out because the rain's up. And that's kind of worry, worrisome. Let's bring in Mercury. Um, and it's like... It's crazy because I know I'll do another uh, Emerald Randomizer. No, um... Extreme randomizer, sorry, and it would be compl a completely different experience. And I, I'll completely forget, completely forget what Pokemon. Um, well, no, I'll, I'll get confused. Sorry, not completely forget. I'll, I'll be super, super confused because I squid over here's ice type. We'll bump into a, Lati a Latios and another extreme randomizer, and I'm just gonna be like, I want to believe, I want to believe that this man is a ice type, but he's not because it's different this time around. It's just hilarious. And the sun is up. Let's get these flamethrowers going, B. Hell yeah. Fuck okay, everything. So, Weezing's actually really got a really good nature because, uh, ability, because he brings up the drizzle and he's weak to fire. I bring Mew in for the, the, the fire and, like, for the drought, which is bad for Mercury, uh, for Squid, actually. Because uh, if they fire a, a fire type attack at me now, see, they look, they, they miss, they miss Zap Cannon here. Why could they not have missed it earlier? So salty about that still. Still so salty about that. Alright, let's flamethrower this Ludicolo. Money Malotad! It's neutral, but the, the sun is up. Hell yeah. Get destroyed, my friend. Get absolutely bodied. Ooh, Mercury, good level level. Getting another level there. I think he learns a new move level 50, and that's it for him, I'm pretty sure. Raikou, psychic type, I'm pretty sure. Ah. Heat wave, stop missing. For real, please stop missing. Do 
Jesus, that did a lot. Considering that did a fair amount. Let's go for the. Uh, let's just flame throw you, and then I'll body slam the Raikou. Get that stab damage real quick. See, a Pokemon like Mew or Jirachi, or Celebi even, don't really matter what type they change into because they have balanced special attack and physical attack, so they can be whatever type they want. So you can have a lot of fun with them then because like, it's like, it's literally like, I can do whatever I want with you. I can make you whatever, you know, it, it's, it's like you're going to be good regardless because your stats are so balanced. It's perfect, basically. Whoa. Then extreme speed my own Pokemon. Gotcha. Way too fast. You're too slow. Alright. Me a level. Dude, Squid is not leveling up. Alright. Scooch on over. Alright, here we go. Strength puzzles. My favorite. Alright, I think it goes bam. 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 Left. Right. Up. Up. Left. Here we go. This is the team for Earthquake. We just got the TM for tackle. I'd like to remind you how much of a bitch that is. The TM for tackle. Ah, hold it right there. So about you, after all. Behold, see how beautiful it is, the sleeping form of the ancient Pokemon Kyoga. I have waited so long for this day to come. Arr. It surprises me how you've managed to chase me here. But that's all over now. For the realization of my dream, you must disappear now. Let's go, Archie. Face me. Oh my fucking god. Suicune! Hold up! What typing are you? I want one. I want one. It's resisted. Okay. It's steel type? It's got Doom's Eye. Okay, okay, okay. It's steel type. That's fine. Because I can just flip around and go BAM! Catch this flamethrower. It's neutral. Ooh, you have a second typing. Oh Jesus, I should switch out. I should switch out. I should. I, I, what am I doing? I'm playing with fire. E, I'm playing with fire. I'm playing with fire. I'm playing with fire. Uh, steel type. Uh, probably steel water. Maybe. Uh, maybe. I don't know. It's using steel type moves. Maybe we should just go in adjacent. If it's steel water, then yeah, let's go. Let's do this. Let's do this. Hello. I am here. Steel rock. Shit. That's fine. Rock tomb. Steel wing. Doom desire. Okay, I think we're good. I'm gonna take the Doomsday attack, which is gonna do nothing. Goodbye! Not doing that. Okay, 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 okay. Bam, hold this. <laughs> just, just get out of here, Suicune. You're a threat, dude. You're actually a threat. It's got two physical typings. Which is kind of crappy because Doom uh, Tweakun's got good special attack, but it's very bulky, so it, it does make up for it. Hari Ama. <gasps> he is a still grass type. I remember. He has color change. So we have to hit him with this one E wave, we, otherwise, he will change type and that will suck. Fuck! Wait. That's fine, that's fine. Oh, damn it, I'm taking the Doom's Eye attack as well. No! No. Okay. I don't remember what moves you get, bro. Because I only had you for a short period of time. But that Doom Desire <laughs> That's a beast. Swift. Okay, that's fine. That's gonna do nothing. Uh, let's go for the Sea Wave. Come on, land it. Boom. That's quite effective, dude. I remember your typing, Hariyama. Bam. Alright, sweetness. Bodied. Rapidash. No idea what typing this is. Let's get Cookie some. Let's get some Cookie some screen time right now. He has not been doing a great deal. So let's get him. Let's get him on screen to finish this battle for us. Rapidash is level 43. Okay, we should be fine. High jump kick. We have massive physical defense. We eat. It. Okay, maybe not. 
That's not gonna kill either. Yo, Kingler is so good. Jesus Christ. Full HP, not super effective. Uh, two levels higher than us. That's incredible. Kingler is actually a boss. Ah, I commend you. I must recognize that you are truly gifted. But I have this in my possession with this red orb. I can make Kyogre. The red orb suddenly began shining by itself. Deuces. Kyogre, use fly. Dar, what? I didn't do anything. Why did the red orb? Why did where did Kyogre go? Hmm, it's a message from our own brother outside. Yes, what is it? Hmm, it's raining heavily. Good, that should have happened. That was why we awakened Ko Kyogre. To realize Team Aqua's vision of expanding sea. What? It's raining far harder than you envisioned? You're in danger? This can't be. It's not just possible. That's not possible. Hold your position and monitor the situation. There's something wrong. The red orb is supposed to awaken and control Kyogre, but why? Why did Kyogre disappear? Why? Ah, what have you wrought? Wait. Archie, have you finally uh, uh, awoken Kyogre, haven't you? Well, you finally awoken Kyogre, haven't you? What will happen to the world if this, if this downpour continues for all eternity? The world's landmass will drown in a deepening sea. What, what? Don't get all high and mighty with me. Wasn't it you, Team Magma, that infuriated Groudon? So long as I have the red orb, I should be able to control Kyogre. I should be able to control it. We don't have time to, uh, to argue about it here. Get outside and go see for yourself. See if what you've wrought is the road that you desired. Luke, come on, you have to get out of here too. And it's pouring down. It's raining. You guys are thick. Dumb idiots. Dumb people. And then the sun comes out, right? Does the sun not come out as well? Or is it just rain? There it is. Alright, my dudes. Hmm, Luke, what is happening? This is terrible after the scorching heat. Wait, you can't fly here! Steven, you cheater! After the scorching heat wave ended, this deluge began. If this doesn't stop, all of her and no, the whole world will drown. This huge rain cloud is spreading from the from above Sutopolis. More than what is taking place, there is no point arguing here. Sutopolis might provide answers. Luke, I don't know what you intend to do, but I don't do it. Don't do it. But don't do anything reckless. Okay, I'm going to Sutopolis. Sick! Okay, so after this shenanigan shit's happened, we can go ahead and actually um go get uh Rayquaza, I'm pretty sure. So let's go ahead to go ahead and take over to, to take off to Sutopolis. I don't know why they choose Sutopolis to come to there. It's weird. Maybe because the Cave of Origin here, maybe? Yo, look at these men. They're about to take up. They're about to freaking. They're about to fight to the death. Damn. All right, be right back, guys. <laughs> Hello. I feel, like the, I feel like the woman should be like, hey, what's going on out there? Let's see, maybe heal your Pokemon up. She's just like, hello, welcome to our Pokemon Center. I hope you have a good day. It's like, have you seen what's going on outside, Nurse Joy? Have you, have, you, have you seen the crap that's going on out there? Are you sure you, you want to take a look-see? All right, Squid, take me over here. Hop. Hello. Ground on, please stop what you're doing. I, I have, I know the extent of your power now. If you keep going all ho and not just to topless, be utterly ruined. Ah, Kyogre, what's wrong? Look up here, it's the red orb. Calm down, Kyogre. It's not good, it's not responding at all. Uh, let's go see Mr. Steven. Come here, Latios. Boing. Those Pokemon fighting Ground on Kyogre, the two super ancient Pokemon, were awakened from a long sleep, and now they're smashing each other with uncontrollable energy. Luke, you being here now. I'll take it to mean that you're prepared to become involved in this crisis. Well then, there's something that I'd like to I'd like for you to meet. Please come with me, please. La 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 Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Just keep walking. Why can't you walk and talk? I know there's code in this game to make people walk and talk. So why do they make you stop? To have a conversation. It's crazy. Hello. It's time. Okay, here we are inside. You'll find someone named Wallace. I think you'll have what's needed to help him. All right, we can get a Pokemon in here, so we're gonna snag one up. Before I go too far in here, I wanna get a Pokemon, so let's do this. You can actually go through this whole thing 
that encounter in a single Pokemon, so be careful if you want to get an encounter in here. Come on. Give me the money. There it is. It's a Cacturn! He's doing the freaking stanky leg. Okay. Do stanky leg. I am going to surf you. Because I think you resist water. You're neutral to it. That won't kill though, right? I thought you resisted water for some reason. I know it's I know Cacturn's actually a grass type, but like his randomized form, I thought also they didn't get affected by my bad. That's my bad. So are you, Luke? I've heard tales of your exploits. My name is Wallace. I was once the gym leader of two topless when I came up, and uh, so now I have entrusted my uh, mentor, Juan, Juan, in the gym's operation. Crowd and Koga, the two Pokemon, wreaking havoc, here are considered to be super ancient Pokemon. But if there aren't just two super ancient Pokemon, there's one more somewhere. Somewhere that is super ancient Pokemon named Rayquaza. It is said that it was Rayquaza that became the two combatants in the distant past, but even I have no clue as to where Rayquaza's whereabouts. Do you perhaps know where Rayquaza is now? If you do, please tell me. Okay, so the thing is, I don't understand. It's like, why would we know in this situation where he is? Cave Origin. The Cave Origin, but that's right here. Alright, so then we do Mount Pyre. Oh, I pushed B for that. I, whatever. That's a problem. Can't you remember somehow? Mount Pyre. The one I met Lord Lee there earlier, she's had no mention of it. And then it's like, it, ma it makes you pick Sky Pillar. It's, just, it, it's weird. The Sky Pillar? That's it. It must be the Sky Pillar. Look, but we don't even know where the Sky Pillar We've never been there. Look, there's not a moment to lose. We'll head to Sky Pillar right away. Alright, let's skedaddle. Which is cool, because we get to um, encounter Rayquaza, not fight him necessarily. But once we do fight him, he's awoken, and we can head back to Sky Pillar after we're done here and actually encounter him, which means we can go ahead and try and catch whatever the Pokemon is randomized to. So. I'm gonna take off the Sky Pillar right now. Our end fam. Where's Sky Pillar? Pacific Log, here we go. Hello! The raining and stuff has stopped here, though. Alright. Sky Pillar is located just north of here. Sort of northeastish. Where is it? There's also a Mirage Tower as well. Um, but I don't know how often that appears. Mirage Island or something like that. It's like up here. Wait! Okay, this is Sky Pillar. I thought I found Mirage Island for a second. I was like, wait, hold on. Mirage Island is like an, an next to impossible to get to it to, to get though. It's like it's like a bunch of like random variables that line up. Oh my, I'm terribly sorry. I, in my haste, I didn't notice I left you behind. I've opened the locked door of the Sky Pillar. Let's be on our way. It's, it's an earthquake. We have not a, we haven't got a wait, uh, moment to waste. All right, let's do this. Get me in there, bro. Sign me up. The situation is getting worse. This isn't good. The weather distortion is spreading even here. Luke Rayquaza should be further up here. I'm worried about Sutopolis. I've got to go back. Everything is in your hand now. Don't fail us. All right, my dude. I got this. I got this, fam. Pretty sure we can encounter a Pokemon here. So should we wait? Yeah, okay, hold on, hold on. There we go. First encounter, Sky Pillar is... Kadabra. Enders has returned. Hello, mate. We'll play dupes calls on this one. We'll skip this one. We'll skip on out and we'll skip, skip out. Let's get some on the second floor instead. Because the randomizer will be picking different mons, so. And uh, there. Did I miss it? Yeah, I missed it. Give me another one. Find me another Pokemon right now. What about here? Unless there are no Pokemon on this floor, for some reason. There are Pokemon on here, on this floor though. Kabutops, which you already have also. Damn, there's just dupes in this room. It's literally just dupes. Another dupe! That's wild! Sunflora? Fuck! I don't want Sunflora! Shit. We got a Sun Cone, but. Okay, you're level 37. If you can't survive a surf, I'll have something to say about it. There we go. There we go. Okay, it's fine. You're dragon type. Yo, some floor and crit! Oh, come on! The last surf critical hit it. My bad. Got a dragon, some floor, Jesus. All right, whatever. What should we find something on this floor now? And it's actually ridiculous. Smeagle? We could have had a Smeagle. Definitely upset now. 
absolutely upset, actually. What am I talking about? I just missed out on, like, the best Pokemon. Forward slash sarcasm. Alright. Oh, no, that's just super power. Get to, get to the freaking gist of things. Hello! Rayquaza, wakey wakey, rise and shine. Bye. See you later, bro. Alright, sick. Wow. We sent Raikou, uh, Raikou? Raikouza off on his way. Uh, in the next episode, we'll be flying back to Zootopolis. Uh, and I actually really want to fly back straight back to Sky Pillar in the next episode and actually encounter Rayquaza and see what Rayquaza is. But, um, it'll be interesting, that's for sure. If you guys have enjoyed this episode, please leave a like rating down below. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for your support. And get hyped for the next episode because we'll be find out what the hell Rayquaza randomized to. Thank you all so much for watching again. I'll see you guys next time.